Chris Tripp, big fall over the highest ranked rec uh, wrestler for the uh, Boilermakers. Okay, and Logan Brown, he's kind of a jacked freak, like big dude. Definitely. <laughs> Definitely. How'd you catch him and you stepped over him, huh? Um, he just came in, I was adjusting my headgear and he came in for a, kind of a sloppy shot and I just caught him with it. I felt it, ran him over, bumped him over, just took it slow, crunched it, came across with the, the elbow to the face and just stuck it, you know, just okay. stay tight with it. <laughs> and you're no stranger to beating, beating like kind of big dogs because you, <laughs> in the state finals when you're actually got a win over Mike Pasilla. Definitely, definitely. So you're, this is no, not, not anything big to you, huh? Right, right. Okay, uh, what's up next uh, for you? Well, this is my last year, so I'm, I'm leaving it all on the mat, you know. This is my last semester wrestling, so i got to just leave it out there. You know? I'm trying to start a legacy or help start a legacy from Notre Dame, so we have an actual program. This is only our second year in existence. You know? Third. Third year, third, third in existence, so, so I'm real pumped about that. All right, Chris, you started out at Boston U. Uh, Jeffrey, he started out at Indiana. Right. He said D1 wasn't for him. What's what, what was it for you about D1? Um, I liked it, but the problem was, you know, for me, I'm, I try to stay, I have to stay healthy, and the way they were running us, we had three practices a day, and I just didn't think I, you know, necessarily fit with that, you know, trying to, you know, three practices a day, and I was trying to, my most important thing is education, trying to get my degree, and it was so hard for me, you know, to try to balance both, you know, with Boston University, it's a private school, and it was, it's a really hard school, you know, so, and I wanted to do well with both, so it seemed like it was kind of a clash, so it was like a give and take. So wait, you're saying that uh, education is important to you? You only want the university? <laughs> university, <laughs> exactly. man. Exactly. <laughs> university. It's only uh, 24 grand a year, huh? Okay. Right. You went to a, a a high school. Talk about that a little bit. U.S. Uh, you were one of. I was, were you the first state I was champ? The first state champ. Okay, US. so you actually got. Uh, was it Boardwine at the time? Yep. Coach Boardwine and, and Sean Dennis Gross. Bailey. Dennis Baylor. Dennis Baylor. Okay. Right, right. You got them rolling. Talk about that a little bit. Um, it was a real cool thing because we started off, we didn't really have a good wrestling team, and um, we had great coaches come in, we had great people coming in and out of the room, so it really helped amplify the room. And we, like our goal, my, my goal personally, was to be the first state champ and start, you know, start the legacy there as well. And we did it, we brought in a bunch of good guys, we just kept working hard, our coaches were on us, you know, they, they ran us through so many crazy practices, but it all turned out in the end, you know, turned out really well. And the winning states, then we had Adam Korinsky following and a bunch of different from state, state champions and state placers. And right now they're doing really well. You know, they're top contenders in the state every year. So definitely started that legacy. Okay, if education is so important to you, what degree are you going to leave here with? I'm leaving with accounting, uh, bachelor, bachelor's in accounting, uh, minor in international business and finance, and then I'm going on to grad school after this to get my, ma my MBA and as well get my master's in accounting. So now would you consider doing uh, like a D1 GA position? Definitely. If, if, it, if it's available, I definitely would. Definitely was. So. All right, Chris, you got anything else for the people out there? I'm just trying to work hard and make this my last shot. You know, this is all I have, so I'm leaving it up on the mat. So. All right, Chris Tripp with the big win tonight with the big upset over the Purdue Boilermaker, Logan Brown, and uh, good luck at Nationals. Thanks, thanks, Chris.